big break in a high-profile Dallas murder. Faustino Valdez, the man accused of killing his ex-girlfriend, Marisol Espinosa, is finally in police custody after he was found hiding in Mexico. Andre Lucia live tonight outside the Espinosa family home where she spoke to the victim's relatives. A Mexican newspaper broke this news early this afternoon, but it wasn't until late this evening a Dallas police detective called the family here to confirm it was true. I spoke to them just an hour ago about what this means. I want to thank everyone for all their prayers. For Marisol Espinosa's family, nothing can fix their heartache. Her three beautiful kids, <laughs> my sister, her mother, us, her close family would live without her. But not if a moment that she will not be in our hearts. But the arrest of Faustino Valdez, they say, marks a big step forward today in their fight for justice. We are thankful now that we can confront him, the person that was responsible for taking our loved one away. Family members reported the mother of three missing in December of 2015 after she failed to show up for work as a hairstylist at North Park Mall. Her body was found three months later under a bridge in southeast Dallas. She gave me a kiss goodbye and said she was leaving to work. Interviewed at a vigil for Marisol, her ex and father to two of her children, Valdez claimed he had no idea what happened. But the FBI says he disappeared after being questioned by police. The Mexican newspaper Millennio reports federal law enforcement officers there discovered Valdez during an immigration raid at a factory in Mexico. The report claims he was working there under a fake name, but fell under suspicion when he couldn't prove his Mexican citizenship. No, you know. no, Valdez's family today told me they had nothing to say. Marisol's relatives, meanwhile, are already preparing themselves for the day he goes to trial. We will get justice for Marisol. Oh, we've confirmed right now Valdez is at the Dallas Police Department. He arrived at DFW tonight on a flight from Mexico. Detectives say they want to question him before booking him into the Dallas County Jail. Reporting live in Dallas, Andrea Lucia, CBS 11 News.